Hello. I've upgraded the pedals for Marduk. So now that they function properly, um, never mind that little fellow, he's another project. He's a broken, um, Robo Sapien that I picked up at Goodwill for ten bucks. His arms are broken. I'm gonna take him apart and fix them. Maybe make a video about that, but here are the 3D printed pedals. They neatly clip into each position. You've got one way, um, not on, and then the other way for the linear actuators. And we can peek under the bottom. You can see we've got the switch in the center. And then we've got two sort of like guide axles on each side. That way it gives a three-point contact, giving a lot of good stability to these pedals. So, I will be installing these, um, you know, pretty soon, this entire unit, which is actually the heart of the steering and um, hip rotation system. You know, just simple switches, it's amazing. What you can do with just basic um, parts, N never mind having to get like crazy control, you know, circuits and whatnot. So I will be installing this, and then we'll be probably stabilizing the um, knuckle mounts in the steering system because, as in one of the previous videos, they were only held on um, one side. So make them nice and stable so the wheels turn properly and I replaced the wobbly bolt I was talking about finally in the um, hips it's a little uh, you know dark out so I wouldn't get a good picture probably do a small video about that in the morning and then all I have to do is install this and put in some sort of camera system so I can actually see out the door of Marduk because you know peep up camera pie cam died so I might use my drone to peek out or something something hmm. and then we'll be able to do a full system test including you know an engine and uh, the pedals to rotate the hips and all steering and all that good stuff so you can look forward to that and maybe a little video um a more edited video with me taking them apart seeing what's wrong and hopefully fixing him so he's good as new but no avoid no no little robots i've actually got one of these um in storage upstairs a transparent robo sapien but you know i'd have to dig him out of his box put some batteries in and then i'd have two um their signals would probably conflict with each other because it's all uh, infrared signals so wouldn't be able to get them to fight but hey no I've all, no little robots yet work on the big robot so Shouldn't be too many more videos until I have a full systems test. Be sure to like and subscribe, and I will see you next time. Bye-bye.